This year marks the 75th anniversary of artist Minae Akubo's illustrated memoir, Citizen 13660. Published in 1946, it was the first book-length account of America's concentration camps written by a former incarceree. Through a series of nearly 200 illustrations, each accompanied by a caption, Minae Akubo documented how World War II and the incarceration that followed upended her life. To commemorate the milestone anniversary of her iconic work, the Japanese American National Museum has organized the exhibition Minae Akubo's Masterpiece, The Art of Citizen 13660. Not only does the exhibit include 28 of the original drawings from her illustrated memoir, a second exhibition room highlights the art that inspired the 1946 book. A myriad of sketches she completed while incarcerated, a sketchbook, and a draft of the final manuscript. It is the first time this artwork and related materials have been exhibited. Akubo's interest in capturing the diversity of the incarcerated population at both Tanfran Assembly Center and Topaz resulted in several thousand quick sketches that developed into character studies, portraits, and scenes replicating daily life in the camp. These sketches created while she was incarcerated inspired drawings included in Citizen 13660. Two loose sketches show a number of incarcerees devising ways to carry cumbersome mattresses stuffed with hay back to their barracks, while other sketches show individuals sewing and women at wash tubs in a laundry room. Together, the materials in the Minea Kubo collection provide a glimpse into how Akubo witnessed and framed the telling of the World War II incarceration of Japanese and Japanese Americans. And now, for the first time, that artwork as well as the materials that detail the creative process behind Minae Akubo's masterpiece are being exhibited at the Japanese American National Museum, revealing the art of Citizen 13660. Thank mm -hmm. you.